59% say release medical records. What's wrong with her? So why won't the mainstream media talk about this story? And will the Clinton campaign release Hillary's full medical records? Joining us now from the Fox News Medical AT, medical correspondents, Dr. Mark Siegel and Dr. David Samadhi, and former 2016 GOP presidential candidate, Dr. Ben Carson. Dr. Carson, um, I'll show you the different examples. She's falling. You've got this sort of twitching thing that she does in front of reporters that was really bad. There's been a number of incidents and reports that she fell and then she had this really long incident where she was out of commission for quite a while, recovering her husband said. She's on anticoagulants. Um, number one, do we have a right to know? And number two, what do you make of this, this twitching thing that she keeps doing? I'll, keep, I'll run it again. <laughs> well, you know, why are you laughing? You're Certainly. the brain surgeon here. I'm just a humble little post. <laughs> it just looks funny. Uh, you know, certainly um, as a person gets older, you know, the number of, of medical conditions uh, that we have to watch for increases, which is one of the reasons that we strongly suggest as you get older that you have at least an annual examination. Uh, if you're going into a very important position like this, it's, it's critical. Right. And uh, that information should be something that we should have access to because it's very important in terms of making that decision. Also recognize that the presidency is not a nine to five job. You yeah. know, it is extraordinarily grueling and you need to, to have everything right. going for you. And also the mental capacity. You know, yeah, there are stressful. standardized me mental examinations, uh, many mental exams, about 30 questions. You can get a very quick assessment in terms of what's going on. These are the kinds of things that should be open to the public in making such a critical decision. All right.